All right, I'm back. The video cut off. I don't know what happened there. So, what I was saying is that, okay, your hook, your hook is gonna go here. Okay, let me explain to you. I already took out everything out. So your hook is gonna go here, about right there. What you wanna do is, when you have it there, what you wanna have it there is pull it. Once you pull it, you should feel that the the resistance be loose of the of the pump, which you will hook right about here. So once you get it here, once you lift this up or something like this, right here, once you lift this up, it should be able to release the, the, the grip out of the fuel pump. So yeah. All right, guys, this, that will be it for uh, for this video. Hopefully it was uh, uh, helping enough, you know, I can explain the first two videos. I had a lot of problems before with it. I couldn't figure it out. I didn't know what was causing it and why it was causing it. You know, I changed the spark plugs. You can see I still have the spark plugs there. I changed the distributor cap. I changed the rotor cap and I even did a whole tune up, you know, just to make sure it was that and it wasn't that. So, at the end of the day, we end up finding out with just a fuel pump. Hopefully, it's that. And if it's not, we're going to continue uh, looking for the issues of why this truck keeps idling. But so far, it looks it's the fuel pump. Anything else, I don't see it. Unless there's a time off or something. But, like, you guys saw in the first video, it went on. It had no issues until, like, in the second video. Was it was on after 10 minutes it was just uh, idling really rough and uh, yeah all right guys i'll let you go hopefully you find this video really, very very helpful and if you have any comments or any suggestions let me know and i'll, I'll see what i could do thank you